Loftus Versfeld Stadium is a rugby and association football stadium situated in the Arcadia suburb of Pretoria, Gauteng, South Africa. The stadium has a capacity of 51,762 for rugby union. It is occasionally used for local football matches as well. Owned by the Blue Bulls Rugby Union, the stadium is the home ground of the Bulls franchise of the Super Rugby Tournament and the Blue Bulls Union in South Africa's Curry Cup. It also hosted the 2009 Super 14 final which the Bulls won 61-17 against the Waikato Chiefs, and the 2009 Curry Cup final, which the Bulls went on to win 36-24 against the Free State Cheetahs. Also, the South African National Rugby Union team has played several test matches at the Loftus Versfeld Stadium. He played New Zealand in 1970, 1996, 1999, 2003 and 2006, Australia in 1967, 1997, 2001, 2005, 2010 and 2012, England in 1994, 2000 and 2007, and Ireland in 1998. In June 2010, the stadium hosted opening round games and one game of the round of 16 of the 2010 FIFA World Cup. History the stadium was named after Robert Loftus Owen Versfeld, the founder of organized sports in Pretoria. Through the years the stadium has undergone various name changes as sponsors came and went, though locals have always referred to the stadium as Loftus Versfeld. From June 11, 1998 to February 4, 2003 the stadium was officially named Minolta Loftus after Minolta became the stadium's name sponsor. Sponsorship was taken over by security giant Securica, who announced the name Securica Loftus on February 5, 2003. On September 1, 2005 the renaming process went full circle when cellular provider Vodacom, taking over sponsorship from Securica, renamed the stadium back to the original Loftus Versfeld. The site of the stadium was first used for sports in 1906, and the field was simply called the Eastern Sports Ground. The first concrete structure was erected there by the city council in 1923. The original structure could only accommodate 2,000 spectators, and did not have proper sports facilities. In 1928, mostly because of the All Blacks tour to South Africa that year, the Pretoria Sub-Union made a large profit which they used to erect changing rooms and toilets. When Mr. Loftus Versfeld died suddenly in May 1932 the Pretoria Subunion renamed the Eastern Sports Ground after him as a tribute to a man that had done so much to develop sport in the area. The stadium has been known as Loftus Versfeld Stadium ever since. It has been upgraded on several occasions, most recently in 1984, when the Northern Pavilion received an upgrade. Loftus Versfeld now has a large amount of world-class facilities which make it a wonderful place to play, or to watch sport matches or events. There are many suites for enjoying a hospitality package, accessible restrooms, numerous food kiosks as well as many areas outside of the stadium for alcoholic beverages. The stadium is a non-smoking stadium and patrons are not allowed to access the stadium seating areas with alcohol. Loftus Versfeld has many great viewing points all over the stadium, making it an easy venue to view any kind of sports event. Events equals 1995 Rugby World Cup equals Loftus hosted some matches during the 1995 Rugby World Cup equals 2009 FIFA Confederations Cup equals Loftus Versfeld was one of the venues for the 2009 FIFA Confederations Cup. It hosted the Group B matches USA vs. Italy, USA vs. Brazil and Brazil vs. Italy. Equals 2010 FIFA World Cup equals, minimal upgrading was undertaken in order for Loftus Versfeld to qualify as a venue for first and second round matches for the 2010 FIFA World Cup. The floodlights, sound system, scoreboards and stadium roof were improved, as roads and parking facilities around it. While expected to be finished in August 2008, renovation was completed in January 2009. Equals concerts equals, the stadium has hosted many musical events including concerts by UB40 and Robbie Williams Close Encounters Tour on April 17, 2006 with an attendance of over 56,000. 
Canadian superstar Celine Dion also performed as part of her Taking Chances tour a two-night stand at the stadium on 16th and 17th February 2008 with a total attendance of about 80,000. Equals Boxing Equals, on October 20, 1979, South African heavyweight boxer Jerry Kouezi challenged the unbeaten American heavyweight John Tate for the vacant WBA World Heavyweight title in front of a crowd of 80,000 people. Despite massive support within the stadium Kouezi lost on points to the American. See also, List of African stadiums by capacity. References External links, Vodacom Blue Bulls, Stadium Picture The Telegraph Virtual Tour of Loftus vs. Feld Extreme Definition, Loftus vs. Feld Virtual Seating Plan, FIFA Profile